What's the morning? We're about to get another reaction today. We're hopping into the Vampire Diaries episode number three, season number five, called Original Sin. Hopefully, it's a good episode. Hopefully, it's a lot of fun. Hopefully, you guys have been enjoying the series. If you have, like, comment, subscribe to the channel. Hit you on for the full reaction. Uncut episodes over there if you want. If you don't, totally cool. Episodes will be here on YouTube whenever they show up. So, previous episode. The previous episode, we essentially. Stefan got out. He got out of the uh, safe somehow. He appears to have killed somebody, but it's probably the Ripper, Stefan. Um, Silas got to the camp, uh, to the campus. We left Caroline there. She met a guy, probably a bad guy. What else? What else? What else, what else was there? I can't remember if there's anything crazy else to happen besides that. I know Silas is working with those witch people, these guys. Um, yeah, um, there's a bunch of conversations in the thing about my whole stuff about the race and everything. And some of you guys don't see it, and that's totally cool. I just see it and I point it out. I know some of you guys don't like it, but it just it's there. It's front center for me. Um, if you guys don't see it, it's totally cool. But I'm just gonna point it out if I see it because if it bothers me, my reactions are literally stuff that if I whatever comes up to my brain in the moment, I just kind of say it. So just what it is. Um, so yeah, we're gonna hop in here. Original sin. Here we go. Empire Diaries. I'm Elena. I'm Stefan. Love. Bro. Interesting. I'm Elena. I'm Stefan. And I'm going on the love route with them again. They let him out kind of quick, which I'm happy because I didn't want him to suffer more. But I thought it would have been a bigger thing. He should be good. He just ate a person. Like, My last call was four hours ago. Why is the door open? If you want some coffee, you can put some on her. Yeah, he looks like a. Wow, that's. Holy uh, shit. You must have restless sleep syndrome or something. Damn, I don't like that there's. I don't know, man. This bothers me. No, it doesn't bother you guys, but the whole two Stefans, two Elena's thing. I don't want to hurt you, so get away yeah. from me. Throw it out. Hello to you too. <laughs> he used to be a simple man. Really? I'm not with a simple mm. girl. His soulmate. She was his one true love. <laughs> Blue fire. Clearly, you've nice. heard the man's version of the story. Mm -hmm. The one where I. For you. What? <laughs> Why? But Silas was going to kill you. Doing it myself was the only way to salvage the deal. You put his soul in I there? need his trust. So you slit my throat? You knew the stakes. It I'm just a passenger that you can call out of Matt's head and put away whenever you want. I will find a way I to make this sound... permanent, Gregor. He's making him sound so, he sounds so different. Is Matt's doing an accent, or are they dubbing this? First, you will have an immortality spell. I don't know. I like so this. This is kind of. I don't know. Silas and I were going to drink the immortality elixir. Very solid. I just don't know ceremony. visually if I like this. But then, every. Who is this? They covered her face. She's got to be somebody just important. Your mind. Why does it I look like Catherine you. though? Because all I see is an angel. I don't like this, man. I don't know some of you guys do. This is not cool to me. Like, there's three so, fucking Elena's. Silas was the first version of me, and your friend was the first version of Elena. Silas stole your daylight ring. Why do you need a new one? Well, why, why haven't you when this killed is ready, Silas? Your help to take down Silas once and for all. I, I, you just you seem like. Hmm. I could. Thank you. Oh, Ravane, son of a bitch. Ravane! What did you do? I Catherine is a compulsive liar. But I need her alive. Yep, you're a Just beat this girl's ass. You really do look exactly like her. You find Stefan. Wait, what? 
No, why she almost we, killed you. Yeah, why would we do that? That's like a super plan. We don't have time for a detour. Damon, Stefan's yeah. hurt. Found someone else immortal. Holy shit, she what killed you. You made her immortal and immortal and killed her. That's cool. And now no. you should have walked behind him no. and put that shit in his mouth. She couldn't speak after I cut. See? Yep. We, you know, all things that might be able to be forgiven because you're hot. But what are you actually doing? I want to know what the other girl does. How is she so powerful? This one. Not her, but she does. She's in it's because like, how is she? She's like a warlock and a witch combined. Thank you. I'm glad to know that you care. Like, Even if you are condescending, bitch. And we are kind of wasting time. Oh, what the fuck? Why did we waste time? Damn, I feel like we wasting time. Like, a, what the fuck is this? Oh, you in your compost pile. I'm going to link Stefan to Silas. I knew it. I was going to say. Spell on his doppelganger will neutralize Silas's powers. I was powers. going to say she's going to link weakened, them. Once he's weakened, I will force him to take the cure. Well, that's a great idea. Force the cure down his throat. Cure's gone. Done. It's in. Probably don't want to get on my bad side. You realize you're not the only one with a bad side. Now stop, right? yo. She's mad powerful. You Aren't need to chill. Brave? You need to chill the fuck Without out. Without Silas's bro. mental powers, he is an immortal nobody. We can defeat. What are you two talking about? I thought you can Let go of her arm. I mean, I guess because the mind thing is this, right? So he, once you get the mind I thing out, he can't control people anymore. Which, but he's still aim it at your heart. <laughs> oh shit! What the actual hell? Does that kill him? Like, like him? Like Stefan looks like he is hurt. All right, we're done here. You thought you could be here, man? That's a fucking moron. Yeah, I kind of figured that was the case. Get the cure, so now they get the cure out. We have to probably everybody wants her. What the hell happened here? What the hell is this? Is Matt? Ooh, that's a cool knife, though. Oh, you were digging up the body. Never mind, I forgot. You were digging up that one dude's body. I, I don't think. I have no idea who you people are. Oh, wait, what? That's kind of interesting. Never mind. I'm not expecting. Okay. So this episode is pretty good. Pretty interesting. Brunketia into play. I think that's her name, right? I like the actress. I like the way she plays her. Kind of like the psycho, crazy, vengeful ex-girlfriend i like that i like that a lot actually i like the linking of stefan and um silas also i also like the the um twist where stefan clearly brain was wiped he doesn't remember jack shit about anything so that's also interesting but i like all that the girl that kept that kidnapped Catherine. i don't know i'm not sure if i like her and her boyfriend what they're doing to matt and I'm kind of very lukewarm on that right now. Just kind of got to wait to see where it goes. But right now I'm kind of like, eh, we'll see. We'll see what happens. Um, when it comes to... Um, when it comes to... The way Elena and the, the Elena Stefan... The Elena Damon relationship, Stefan kind of being there. I'm curious to where it's going to go. Because, like, clearly... The way that Ketsio described it was that for 2,000 years, the world or whatever the hell has been trying to put them together. So Damon, like, just an you're just like in the way. You will never end up with her because destiny says no. Essentially, that's kind of interesting. I don't like that. I don't like that they look like so many of them look like each other. Right, the doppelganger thing. It's just weird, right? And, you know, I, I, when it was just Catherine and Elena, I was like, okay, that's cool. But then it's like, oh, now it's, it's Stefan and also Silas are also that. And then, oh, wait, there's another one. The ori like the original one that looks like, I don't know. I can kind of like, I'm very hit or miss on that right now. 
Um, what else happened in this episode that mattered? We got the beginning. I thought the beginning was cool. The way that they kind of like the way that he goes to the bar, he's gonna kill himself. Elena's kind of having the dream, and then Catherine's having the dream, and then it turns out, oh, Ketsi is the one that put the dream in their brains. That makes sense because she needed them to. She needed to get them to get to her. Because we need Catherine, because Catherine is the cure. Uh, interesting twist. Yeah, we go through the whole story of what happened, all that stuff. That was cheated. The math thing. I thought this was really cool. I just don't like the way that he was changed. Like I didn't even know if that, I, I couldn't even tell if that was Matt talking. His voice changed and everything, and I'm like, wait, what's happening here? Um, that's kind of cool. Uh, we then. And more of this background stuff. I thought this was creepy the way she did it and the whole thing with the heart and the blood and everything. That was done pretty well. I thought it was kind of stupid that we were here in the woods talking. Also, I don't know what that girl is because she's like a witch vampire. Where I mean, like, because like, Silas is able to read minds and all that stuff, but this girl, I don't know. She has some type of power. How many people have we seen that could do that in the show that have like witch like abilities? But are actually vampires. I thought this was kind of funny the way that Damon, um, let's see, kind of were going at one another. And then, of course, uh, Lena comes in, goes straight to Stefan, pay attention to Damon. So that's going to kind of feed into everything. What is she doing here? This is when he's saying about that both of them will never stop until the other's dead, right? We wiped his power, so he's not as powerful anymore. That's kind of interesting, right? Because let me go to the scene here. Scene in a bar. This girl does Who the something. the hell are right? you? Catherine is a... Which one of you is Catherine Pierce? She is. Catherine is a compulsive liar. But I need her alive. Don't you do like some witch type... She did the witch thing with Matt's brain. I thought she did something else. I could be wrong, though. Um, yeah, we have the whole talk about, you know, that she, she tells her what Ketia said. And then Stephanie can't remember anything. So very interesting what's going to happen next. Uh, but, yeah, that's the episode. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Like, comment, subscribe. Picture up for reaction. I'm going to get out of here, and I'll talk to you guys later.